What's going on everybody, it's Game Unboxing Reviews here, and welcome back to my LEGO Dimensions Free Roam videos. So, of course, we're still covering the Jurassic World Team Pack, obviously this is the last video because they only come with two characters, but I've obviously already shown Owen and the Raptor, which are really cool, um, I personally love those two characters, that character and that vehicle slash gadget, I just think it's really cool. Um, the Raptor is awesome how fast it is, and Owen has some pretty cool abilities. Now, the thing with the ACU guy is, when I first heard about him, I was like, it was a really strange choice, and I thought he'd probably be the most least used character in all of LEGO Dimensions. Honestly, he's not that bad. He's actually kind of cool. Um, he, he has some pretty funny things to say as well, which is nice. Um, and he comes with the Gyrosphere, which is a great vehicle, which I'll be showing in a little bit. But I'll just show some of the things he can do. Uh, he's got some pretty cool attacks. Uh, if you jump in the air, he has a pretty cool electrical charge attack. Um... That's kind of it, I guess, but I don't know, he's not that bad. He's actually kind of fun to play as. I've played him quite a few times, and yeah, I think the reason I like him, though, is just because of the character. He's just quite funny to talk, to play around with, um, but let's uh, let's bring in the Gyrosphere and check this out. Now, the cool thing about the Gyrosphere, as you saw in my unboxing, it's really small looking, but when you put it in game, it becomes... I if these things are street See, he, he says stuff like that. Uh, it actually becomes full size, so it's pretty cool. So you get a full-size uh, gyrosphere, which you can also upgrade, and I think there's other things you could do to it and stuff like that. It's a pretty cool vehicle, and also it's really good at climbing. Like if you're trying to climb a really high mountain or something, it's really good at climbing it. I guess I can't use that. Oh. Oh well, never mind. So yeah, um, I kind of showed a lot of this world already, so. I'm kind of just going to show a bit of gameplay of the ACU guy, just to give you a rough idea if you like him or not. Honestly, if you don't like the ACU guy, that's perfectly fine, but if you want the Jurassic World team pack, get it for Owen. If you want it for one character, get it for Owen. Don't get it for this guy, because I guess he just kind of tags along. But it is fun to have them both on the toy pad and watch them talk to each other, but... Nah, when I come to this world, I play as Owen. I always play as Owen. But sometimes I have this guy, you know, next to him. Uh... Let's see if we can go uh, shock some dinosaurs or something. Can we attack him? <laughs> okay, that was quite funny. Again! Clever girl. Oh. <laughs> Jurassic Park reference. The ACU guy has gone crazy! He's electrocuting everyone on the park! Oh, he's met his match. The jukebox guy. His worst enemy. Whoa! That was mean. Flipping heck. Is this gonna electrocute him? What? Come on, that would have electrocuted him. He should have been, like, fried by now. Where is the gyrosphere? I can hear the gyrosphere. Can this. It would be so cool if that you could use that on water. I think that'd be quite fun. So basically, in this video, we're just gonna, I guess. Look for some dinosaurs to fight. How about that? We can actually just... I think we can actually just do the same side quest I did in the same one. In the uh, Owen one. But it'll be a little different, obviously, because it's with the ACU guy. So, yeah, the Gyrosphere is a pretty fun vehicle to ride around in. I like it, personally. I think it's kind of cool. Um... Ooh, there. Let's go over here. Okay. Ah! I'm going to taste some dinosaurs. Please don't hate me, guys. I'm sorry. Whoa! This guy is evil. Boom. Alright. Now get out of here. No dinosaurs in this park. Especially after the events of Jurassic World. Let's go see Mr. Mizrani, deal with those raptors. But we're only going to use the uh, shock thingy, whatever it's called. Shock rod? Is that what it's called? Something like that. I'm warning you. I'll try not to make this video too long because I know this character isn't the most use, uh, it isn't the most interesting to watch. But you know, he, he's in the game, so I want to be actually show him. Um, I'm not saying he's a bad character. I'm just saying he's probably going to be the most least used, personally. Um, poor guy. <laughs> Let's go talk to Mr. Ah, I suppose you have come to rescue me. Uh, I, I think we'll skip this because we've already seen it, you know. 
Come on, Raptors! They look like they're up to no good. Oh, cool, he's actually speaking. I love how they actually speak in this when enemies come by, when they don't know how to do a puzzle and everything. Every character does that, and it's so cool. I love that. And that's right. Knock them back to the stone age. <laughs> Whenever it was, we got them from. Stay away. Actually, I think uh, the ACU guy, I think he can charge stuff as well. Oh, I just remembered what we can show with the gyrosphere. We can show another area which was unlocked. Which was locked, sorry, before. So after this, we'll go and I'll go and show that. It's actually the T-Rex Kingdom, I think it's called. I think it's the T-Rex Kingdom. Take that and that and some of this and that. Yeah. Is that it, Mr. Mizzoroni? Uh, thank you. No problem. Okay, let's go. I want to go show that new location. This is pretty cool. I'm going to quickly go show it. I love the boost in this game. I just wish it was a little more powerful. Maybe you can upgrade it even more. Because my vehicle is just level 1. And that's it. No, I, I haven't actually unlocked any different vehicle builds yet. They're really hard to unlock. Like, you need a lot of studs. I think you need a million. Uh, yeah, I think you need a million for each one. And then, of course, you also need gold bricks. So, don't expect to be flying your DeLorean around Hill Valley straight away once you get the game. You're going to actually have to work for it. But, you know, I like that. I, I do like that. <laughs> this thing destroys everything. It's awesome. Oh, there's a Ninjago thing in there. It's tasing time. I kind of prefer the park like this. Z you know what would solve this A good old fashioned ice. Do they actually come back when I do that or not? Oh, they don't. Whoopsie. Well, that's him fired. All right, here it is. So we can go in here like this, and we can use uh, the gyrosphere. And it actually activates this door. And then the door opens. And well, of course, we get some studs, which is nice. But we can actually go inside, which is really cool. And if you go in here like this. Da 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 da. Ta da! Yeah, that's the, this is the short scene from the movie, the T Rex Kingdom area. Pretty cool. I, I like how they actually have this tube. Sadly, I haven't found the T-Rex. I don't think it's actually here. But hey, you know, it's just cool how they let you visit this area. I, I personally think it's awesome. Um, I think you can actually go down there. Let me see if I can find out. I'll have a look. So yeah, the ACU guy does actually unlock some cool areas. Um, honestly, if I had to, uh, you know, if, if somebody asked, is this pack worth it? I'd say yes. I'd say the adventure world alone is definitely worth it. And of course, when you buy more packs, you'll be able to fly around in helicopters and jets and all that kind of stuff. Something you couldn't do in LEGO Jurassic World. Th this is one of the things I love about LEGO Dimensions is, um, you know, you have... Uh, a game like Lego Jurassic World, which I really enjoyed, but it was just strictly like motorcycles and, and, and cars and trucks and things like that. But with this game, you have jets, you have helicopters, you have hoverboards, you've got all sorts of vehicles to explore these worlds. So if you want to get a really high height, um, you know, get a really good view of Isla Nublar in a jet, you can do that. And I just think that's really cool. It really opens up the freedom of the game, you know? So yeah, this is T-Rex Kingdom. Nothing really going on, but still kind of cool. Unless I've missed something. What's that? What's that? Have I... Huh? It says there's something under the ground. Hmm, maybe it's a quest. Or maybe not, who knows? Let's go for another stroll around the park in my gyrosphere. You can also change the color of the gyrosphere as well, which I was quite impressed by. I wouldn't think you'd be able to do that, but you can. So that's pretty awesome. I just wish it could go on ramps. CT Games, if you're watching this, I'd love to see uh, an update where you can, you know, actually jump the ramps with the gyrosphere. I think that'd be nice. Because it is a vehicle after all. Oh, 
use this bit of wood? Sorry, Gray, I can't help. Oh, they were definitely alive. Oh. oh no. We're gonna get um attacked by some Ankylosauruses in a second. Yep, there they are. Come on! I'm right here. Hey ya! Boom. This is a very cruel video and I do apologize. <laughs> very cruel. Blame the ACU guy for his uselessness. Nah, he's not that bad. Okay. Anything else I can show? What's that up there? Anything interesting up here, maybe? Or maybe not, who knows? There's something in that in that volcano, definitely. Um, but I can't get to it because I don't have a flying thing yet. But as soon as I do, I'm gonna have a look. I wanna see what it is. Ah, yeah, see, look, the side quest is purple. It's a purple stud, so you can replay all the side quests. That's pretty cool. I like that. I like that. That's nice. It means I can really show off all the characters and everything, um, you know, as much as possible in these videos, so that's great. See what I mean? How it climbs? Like, look at this thing. It climbs really, really well. You can just go up and up. Push up again. It's crazy. You can climb this as well, I think. Oh, is it met its match? It's met its match. Ah, never mind. Oh no, wait. Hey, it's back on top. <laughs> there we go. So yeah, you can. Uh, this is the. Is this the highest point? No, this is the highest point over here. Ah, see, there's a race up there as well, so there's a flying race. So it wants a flying vehicle up there, definitely. Interesting. Very interesting. We just reach to the top. All right. So that's pretty much it for this video, guys. I mean, like I said, I kind of showed a lot of Owen already, but the ACU guy, he's he doesn't really do a lot. That's the problem. Um, so if I could have shown more, I would have, but honestly, I think really you've seen most of what he can do. Um, but yeah, I personally think the Jurassic World Team Pack is brilliant. I love it. I, I think, you know, LEGO Jurassic World was a great game, but what you're getting in this in terms of the open world is so much better. It really is. And Owen has a lot of new cool abilities. Um, the AC guy says some fun stuff uh, every once in a while. A dinosaur-filled park seems normal now after all those other places. Yeah. Um, and of course, you know, the gyrosphere is a great vehicle. Love riding around that. And the Raptor is just awesome. I love riding around that as well. Alright guys, so I want to thank you very much for watching, stay tuned for lots more videos real soon, and as always, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe.